Hello my dear students today i will discuss about some exercise questions and answers of chapter 5 the topic name is presentation visual effects part 3 the next slide contains chapter 5 questions and answers question number a choose the correct answer question number 1 which of the following is not a master view the options are handout master b is note master c is outline master d is slide master the correct answer is outline master question number 2 how can we change the order of slides the options are a is view presentation views slide shorter b is insert header and footer c is animation tab animation d is view normal presentation the correct option is a view presentation views slide shorter question number 3 how we change the color scheme of the selected theme the options are a is design page setup b is design colors themes c is insert theme colors d is design themes colors the correct option is d is design themes colors the next slide contains the next part of questions and answers question number 4 if we select the link check box we can the options are a is use embedded object b use linked object c use animated objects d use linked slides the correct option is b use linked objects question number b state whether following statements are true or false question number 1 PowerPoint can display presentations in three main views. The statement is false. The correct statement is PowerPoint can display presentation in four main views. Question number 2. Any change made on the slide master are reflected on all the slides in the presentations. The statement is true. The next slide contains the next part of questions and answers. Question number 3. The handout does not allow any change. The statement is false. The handout allows any change. Question number 4. In order to change the size an orientation of slides we can click design page setup the statement is true question number 5 the rehearse timings feature allows you to have an idea about the duration of the entire presentation the statement is true the next slide contains the next part of questions and answers question number C fill in the blanks using the words given below Question number 1 effect that introduce the slides during the slide show are called dash The answer is slide transition Question number 2 dash gives you an idea where images charts and tables can be positioned to create a visual 
impact? The answer is slide layout. Question number 3. A technique adopted to provide movement by displaying a series of slightly different images in rapid succession is called dash. The answer is animation. Question number 4. In order to use the record sound option, we must ensure that dash is attached to the computer. The answer is microphone. Question number 5. A dash is a word, images or button that moves the user to another location when clicked. The correct answer is hyperlink. Students, in this session, I have discussed exercise, questions and answer of chapter 5. Hope all of you have understand this part of the chapter very well. Thank you.